Hold up, I didn't even think these were manta rays, guys. I literally thought there was like floating debris. Yeah, knew what it was. Right here, right on top of it. Actually, I think we're going to be heading out of uh, Redfish Pass and then heading out to some oil rigs today in Jared's 33-foot uh, uh, contender. He just got brand new Suzuki's on it. We got everything rigged up and tied on. We're hopefully going to see some yellowfin tuna, maybe some birds, maybe some weed lines. We're going to vertical jig on some of these oil rigs. I have never been out here before, so to say that I am excited is a understatement. This is uh, serious Nat Geo stuff right here. So hopefully we're gonna be out here. We're gonna make an epic trip today. Winds look a little breezy. Probably gonna be a little bumpy. Nothing, uh, a couple little salty captains can't handle though. So we're gonna bring you guys along for the ride. Hope to see you guys uh, with a big tuna boat side here shortly. Where are we heading right. to go? And midnight loves, baby. Most worst kept secret in the Gulf. <laughs> uh, you you ready, Brian? What did you say you wanted to catch today? Baby marlin. We're going baby marlin fishing today, boys. Baby marlin. So put on your big boy panties because this is where the big fish are. We got all the bait. We got everything we need. I threw the net more times than I should have, and we are heading out. Camera, I can go if you want. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna break it off in a second. Being all wrapped up like that. He's pulling the old alligator move on us. Oh, no, you gotta wait for me to get that gaff in it. Yeah, he's too heavy. Yeah, he's too heavy for one gaff. There's another gaff right here. Epic. I was happy literally with just seeing manta rays to have all these Kobe underneath them. Just epic. Jared says he knew it. Look at him. These manta rays are just out here spinning. These Kobe are just out here literally swimming this rip line feeding. So you can keep two Kobe per person with a 36 inch. Uh, you can keep two Kobe per person. They have to be 36 inches at the fork. Then that guy and that other guy are definitely going to make that. Hey, All, right. All right, what do you think, guys? Get a couple Woo! more. Woo! Get you a contender, boy. You get fish like this first cast. We need four Woo! more. We need four more, guys. Not a problem. You got to catch the next one. That's right. Yeah, I guess the other ones are just so big. There we go. Nice. 
Oh, quick release. Here with the net, Joe. 34 incher. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Gotta love it. Hold on, hold on. We're gonna lose him. I got. All right, he's coming this way. He's coming this way. It's a dinosaur there. He's bleeding out, they should be tired. Oh yeah, you're bringing him up. Yeah, and you want to try to swim him back to us. Just like that. Yeah. Oh crap. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. <laughs> oh, 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 boy. That's how it's done. That's full grown right there. Yeah, just let him kind of go do his thing for a second. Hey, we got that on drone. We got that shit on my fucking camera. And we got that on my GoPro, Brian. How about that for a fucking memory? <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, here we go. Got him. Got him. He's right here. He's right behind him. Drop it. He went for it. He went for it. Oh, look at the man right at the boat. Oh, no. My Kobe is trying to swim with it. Small one? Want to go? Yep. Keeper. Uh, I don't, big one. No, that's not a keeper. We're going to let this guy go. He's probably a keeper. Caught the smallest one. Actually, Jared caught the smallest one. And you have caught the biggest one. Yeah. Yeah, look at that fucking Tobia. Look at that motherfucking Tobia. Jesus, that took us here, boys. <laughs> Landed a free. There we go. Watch that rod. Watch that rod. Watch. Man, back home, I'd be happy with a Kobe like that, but after seeing the one we got in the back of the boat. Here, let me get him out first. Yeah, that'd be great. Beautiful. So Kobe always go ape shit, guys. So kind of just want to let them do their thing. <laughs> Obviously. Get the gap, bro! Yeah, get the gap! Another big one! Look at that big one behind oh. me! Oh, hold on. I'm trying. Real, 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 real. Oh, I got him! <laughs> double, double. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is epic. That's what happens when you take a catfish. Go anywhere, catch him. Oh man, what an incredible experience. Another code coming up. Come on, I'm good, bro. I'm focused on filming and fishing. My fish is good, I got him handled. Mine might be ready, Brian.
far as fucking the rock? Mine's boat side. Oh, he was. Yeah, I guess the other ones are just so big. There we go. Nice. Oh, no, no. Oh, no. Nope. Here we go. Jerry with, oh, the, quick Jerry with the net job. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Here, Brian, film that real quick so you can get me on film. Check this deal out. Here's a flash. Check that out. Check that out. Another cubby down here. Yeah. Oh, it's a good one too. Big old head shake. I know. I, I loosened my drag already. Got lighter jig heads on now since I lost so many on the backs of these. So. For, yeah. So I got the drag a little bit looser this time. Hopefully we won't straighten this hook out. Captain Jerry jig heads are uh, not giant cobia approved. A little bit stronger hook, I think, is all you need. Like whatever the next size up. Yeah, this one's probably not as big as the ones we had before. He's being pretty cooperative. Got leader in the rod tip. Oh, that's right there. Decent one. I'd say not small. Not a small one though. Keeper. Get him in the net this time. Got that sea turtle. Sea turtle net. Full grown. Is that our limit right there? Yep. We got six Kobe. Time to move on to the next freezer filler. Yeah, we're right back into the freezer. Head to the hill. We don't want to get any sandwiches. Dino get chicken sandwich, Brian. Look at that. Caught him on this little worm. Little grub tail. Jig head bent. The hook is definitely bent. We're going to straighten her back out. Thank God. <laughs> all right guys we made it back to the dock safely ended up running about 50 miles one way out this morning maybe 60. didn't end up getting on any yellowfin tuna but we did absolutely melee the cobia caught a bunch of red snapper caught a pompano vertical jigging in 180 foot of water off an of oil rig that was pretty cool uh, i didn't catch it but still I would say that uh, that's probably a pretty rare catch on a vertical jig. But we're going to get the boat loaded up, get these cobia clean. We'll see you guys out there. See you guys back at the house. We got six big cobia. That's a limit here in Louisiana. So we're gonna get these guys filleted up. And uh, we'll just show you how to do it. Okay, we're gonna speed it up so you don't have to watch me do two and a half hours worth of filleting. And we're gonna 
cooked this up, so uh, we'll get started.